Jessa Duggar adores children like the rest of the Duggar family, and she and Ben Sewald have a growing family. Unfortunately, Jessa posted a video explaining the devastating effects her recent miscarriage had on her, and she also addressed her evolving views on birth control. Some followers made specific claims about Jessa's health that her husband, Ben Sewald, disagreed with. Here's what he said. Today reports the Duggar family member posted a YouTube video explaining the situation. She said in December 2022, which marked the end of the first trimester of her pregnancy at the time, she noticed the tiniest amount of vaginal blood, along with other odd symptoms like food aversions, nausea, and fatigue. This caused Jessa to go in for an ultrasound when she got the unfortunate news. As soon as she started taking a look at the baby, I can tell there was some concern in her voice, Jessa said. She said, well, the sack looks good, the baby does not. Jessa had a missed miscarriage where the fetus died or never formed, but the pregnancy didn't yet leave the body. The Duggar family member then had to get a dilation and curettage, D and C, due to her history of hemorrhaging. Probably the most devastating moment was waking up after the procedure was over and just having this hollow feeling inside because you know that the life that was in you is no longer there," she continued. You ever did get to see your baby or say those goodbyes? Some Duggar family followers consider a D and C abortion, making them question Jessa Duggar. Jessa and the rest of the Duggars are staunchly against abortion of any kind. And with the government overturning Roe v. Wade, it puts D and C procedures at risk. Ben Sewald, Jess's husband, doesn't want the public speculating on Jess's miscarriage. He reposted a video on YouTube titled, No, Jessa Duggar Sewald did not get an abortion, along with a passionate explanation. To all of you who have spread lies about my wife, I demand a public retraction and apology for your words, shares, retweets, or likes by which you've slandered my wife, further wounding a grieving woman, Ben captioned the post, according to a Reddit screenshot. Please be humble and respectful enough to recognize your errors and insensitivity and set the record straight to your followers. Thank you. Ben also thanked all who've prayed for himself and Jessa amid this tragedy and the subsequent attacks on Jessa's character. Jessa Duggar and Ben Sewald currently have four children, Spurgeon, seven, Henry, six, Ivy, three, and Fern, one. Jessa mentioned in the YouTube video about her miscarriage that she and Ben are open to having more kids though they don't have a specific number of kids they are shooting for. Ben loves kids, but his main concern is always for my health, getting me time to recover," Jessa added. So, we may have our perfect plan for perfect spacing or whatever, but it doesn't always work out like that.